taking a hold on me Baby, I like your stuff Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Right now I'm in my basement and I'm filming another story time video. This isn't a professional like using my Canon T5i. I'm just using my phone because it would be easier to do this video. I'm um, not using my camera. Um, this is the one of two story time videos that I will be doing today. Um, this story time video, this happened around four years ago. And to give you guys a uh, backdrop to the information, um, we we lived in this uh, community and there were a lot of kids who lived there. Let me make sure I hold the camera correctly. And there were a lot of kids who lived in the community. Um, there was a playground and everything. Um, and we often, the way the playground was set up, it had like a little path. Hold on, I just got a text message. Alright, disappear. Alright. But there was a little path that went around the playground. So it was kind of like a track. So we would often race around the track. And I was known as, I was one of the fastest kids, one of the fastest kids in that community, alright? So, hold on, let me hold this right. Alright, so, um, this one particular day, <laughs> I, I don't know, I guess I was feeling extra, I don't know what to say, but I was feeling myself that day. I was one of the fastest kids, everybody would race me, but I would always win. I was just the fastest kid there in that community. Um, and, um, one day, it was just one day, I was at the playground. I had my computer because I, I would often take my computer to the playground with me because the, they had Wi-Fi there. So the Wi-Fi was there. It was just nice because so I could just go there and uh, edit my videos and make my videos. And it was better because the Wi-Fi there was better than the Wi-Fi that was in the house. So I would often go to the playground to upload my videos after I shot them. And it was just, you know, nice to be outside and everything. So, I, I did, I, back in 2012 when I was doing my videos, I did a lot for you guys. I used to be out there when that playground trying to upload YouTube videos. And it would be thundering outside and lightning. And I'm still up there trying to upload my video. Um, but that was four years ago. If you guys been here since the beginning, then you probably know what I'm talking about. Um, but, yeah, that playground was the spot. So, one day I had my laptop there and this... This little girl tried to race me, but me being extra cocky and everything, I told her, I said, we'll race around one time. What the heck? Alright, I told her if we race around one time, and I said, if she wins, I will let her have my laptop. I had an HP laptop. It was like DV, it was a DV7. It cost around $500. It was a very expensive laptop. It was a good laptop. Was it as good as my Mac? Uh, it was a good computer. They both probably are the same. I say the Mac is a little bit nicer, but that was a good laptop. It was a really, really good laptop. Um. So, anyways, we me and this little girl racing. I ain't gonna say her name uh, out of privacy. Uh, but we were racing. She decided to race me. So we were racing, right? So we're going around the whole the whole playground. Like I said, it, it went around like a track, like a you know, high school track or whatever. So she decided to cut across the playground. So she like she wasn't going around. She decided to cut across. So since she decided to cut across, I decided to cut across. Now this is where <laughs> this is where I messed up at. I messed up badly. Because I said, oh, since you want to cut across, I decided to cut across. So we both were trying to get to the finish line. And I don't know what I was thinking. <laughs> At this time, I had to wait. I was probably around like 160 pounds, maybe. Um, Just to even relive this is, is just traumatizing. I, I thought I killed her. <laughs> I legit thought she died. But technically, it wasn't my fault. She decided that she she didn't run around the whole track. She just ran. Then she tried to cut across the grass, which was just taking a shortcut. So what she did, so she decided to cut across the grass. So me trying to beat her to the finish line, I jumped on the table. <laughs> I was running. 
jumped on the table, launched myself into the air. So I was running, and I was running, I jumped on top of the table, launched myself into the air. Let's say we both got there at the same time. Technically, you could say she beat me, because I guess she got there first, but she cheated. But I was in the air, it wasn't nowhere I could go. So she was there, but when I launched myself into the air, I landed right on top of her. <laughs> it was all 160 pounds on top of her, and that was bad. It was her leg, um, in the, in the, in the title, I'm going to clickbait and say I broke her leg, but her leg was really bleeding. It was, it was bleeding bad, and... After that, we walked her home. Walked her to our house, told her dad what happened. He really, he really wasn't mad about it. He just told her to come in. He cleaned her leg up. I think for a whole week, her leg was like messed up and she had like a little limp. But other than that, guys, I teach you in life, do not ever cheat. But it was just bad because we both got there at the same time and it was just nothing I could do about it because I was trying to get back there. We both got to the finish line almost at the same exact time. I launched myself off the table. I was running, jumped on the table, launched myself into the air. And at that point, I couldn't really go nowhere else. So all that pretty much just landed right on top of her. <laughs> and that is what happened. Um, but that's the end of the story time video. If you guys have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Thank you guys for watching. I am doing another story time video after this so make sure you watch it and i will see you guys next time peace give all my love and nothing's gonna tear us apart i'm more than just a number hey, hey. oh i need someone to love